Welcome to my channel. My name is Nikki. Thank you for stopping by. Today's pour is on a 16 by 20 canvas. And I had a lady um, contact me and she is wanting to buy a piece um, for her daughter for Christmas and her daughter likes blues. And um, so she asked me if I could pull all my pieces that I had in blue tones and she was gonna come look at them. And so I thought that I would create a few more pieces in um, varying tones of blues for her to have um, a bigger selection to look at. So that is the um, purpose of this pour. I just Googled um, color palettes for inspiration. I have the um, Folk Art Treasure Gold in Aqua Marine. I recently got it and I've been itching to use it and so, I just Googled, you know, color palettes with aquamarine and it, I would look for one that had a lot of blues and then I saw this one that had this lime green in it and I was like, oh yes, I'm gonna do that one. So that is what we're doing today. Um, it is in the style that I've been showing a lot lately, y'all, where I just, um, I just pour out on the canvas and move the cup around the canvas. Um, I was more mindful of the speed of the flow um, of the paint from the cup onto the canvas just because I didn't want these colors to get muddy. The green was against a lighter blue and it could have went south really fast. Um, so I took it nice and slow. It took a little bit more time to get on the canvas, but um, it was worth it because I, I was able to see that the colors stayed very um, separated, like distinct. You could see each color that I had put into the cup. So I was happy that I took the time to do that. Um, so yeah, I, did, I included dried results. Well, you saw close-ups at the beginning of the video. This piece come out really beautiful. I was very happy with how this one looks. And um, I think she might... Um, the lady might like it as well out of I've got I've got a fair few probably five or six larger pieces in blue tones but there's one of them I refuse to sell um so I'm gonna hide it before she comes over so she can't she can't have that one <laughs> um but uh yeah so if I was gonna buy a piece I would buy this one I think it's very pretty and it turned out very nice it is, um, what is today? My brain is literally, today is September the 10th and it is almost 9 p.m. Um, I had a ton of schoolwork to do and it was in finance and my head is hurting for me because finance, have, 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 have I mentioned how much I hate finance? <laughs> um, but the good thing is my teacher is pretty chill and um, yeah, she, she's cool. She does a lecture every other Thursday. So um, there's a little bit more hands-on with it, which is definitely needed for that class. So that's nice. Um, and then I have got Management 611, <laughs> y'all. Oh my goodness. Management 611 is learning the SPS statistics program um i'm not gonna bore you with with the you know the particulars but i feel like this class should have come with a subscription to an emotional support group that's how i feel because i need it i just need somebody to hold my hand and tell me it's okay and i'm gonna make it through this class because it's hard and it's not I don't know I like to have a video to accompany my classes and there's no videos in this class it's just like here's your book read the book now you should know how to work this program and I don't have a clue um, so it's taking me about four times longer than I guess a normal person if there is such a thing when it comes to SPS statistics analytics whatever it's supposed to be um, yeah, I don't think there's a normal for this program. Whoever does this for fun, bless your heart. That's all I can say. Bless your heart. Because Miss Nikki, we're not going to do this for fun. 
Um, then, oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Y'all, if there is one thing in this world that I absolutely despise doing, it is getting gas, putting fuel in my car. I have an idea. I have an idea. For all these car dealerships, though, I don't want a lifetime warranty. I don't want a free oil change. I don't want that. I'll pay for my oil change. I'll pay to fix my car if it breaks down. You know what would sell me? Is if you would offer me a lifetime subscription service to somebody coming and picking my car up and putting fuel in it for me. I'm not saying pay for the fuel. I'll pay for the fuel. I'll tip you like a valet. I just want someone else to have to go through standing outside that car and holding that little lever and hoping and praying to God that it just doesn't regurgitate gasoline all over my feet because that's always what happens. Now, is it partially my fault? Absolutely, because what am I doing? I'm trying to get every drop of gasoline I can in that tank on this turnaround so I don't have to go back any sooner than I have to. And so, it usually leads to, um, to my very nice fragrance being in competition with the smell of gasoline for the rest of the day if I go do it on my lunch break. And that's what happened today. Um, <laughs> and what's that Paul Harvey says? And that's the rest of the story. My life is a mess. Anyway, this poor, I think in the center of it, it looks a lot like a hummingbird. Um, I have a lot of tattoos and on one of my feet, foot, one of my feet, one of my feet, I have a hummingbird tattooed on it. It's my mother's favorite bird. So I got that in memory of her, not for her because she is not a fan of my tattoos, but um, hummingbirds are her favorite. I got a hummingbird on my foot and this design in the center looks like a hummingbird to me. Um, and I just think it's really, really pretty. So. Um, it just come out so nice and it dried well and there's so many interesting things going on in this in this port I just I can't be happier with it um, it's just oh so pretty so I'm excited to do more um, pieces with that treasure gold but I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will speak with you all very soon Bye.